Hey everyone, it's YouTube Media. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to install and download fonts onto your computer for free so you can get them working in any program such as Notepad, Photoshop, or anything else. So, the website you go to is called dafont.com, D-A-Font.com. Link will be in the description. This is where you can download and install free fonts. So there's tons of different categories. I'm just going to click on top to go to the top 100. And let's just quickly pick one here. I'm going to choose... Okay, let's say I want master plan. So you can click on it, and you can actually preview the text by typing in a text right here to see what it looks like. Choose your size, I'll choose large, click submit, and there you go, that's what it's gonna look like. So you can get a preview of any text. Not all of the fonts have a preview for you to use, but most of them do, such as this one. So once you find one you like, just go ahead and click the download button on the right to the font and it's going to bring up the save file, save it, save it to wherever you want. I'm just going to do my desktop and then we're going to go to the desktop and now what you got to do is extract the files extract all okay and then it brings up the extracted files, let's throw that away so what you're going to do and here is the font right here there's an image here and there's a readme instructions ignore that you want this one right here that's called true type font that's the type of the file it is you're going to right click and then click install continue there you go, it's now been installed. So let's look for that font called Master Plan. Bring up Notepad. Let's look for it. Master Plan. Doo -doo 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 -doo. There it is right there. Master Plan. So we can now type in it. Look at that. There you go, that's the font. So we now just installed a font. Now this will also work for Windows 7, but for Windows XP, what you will have to do is, once you've extracted the font, what you have to do is go to your Start menu, press My Computer, and then C drive, click on Windows, and then you're going to click on fonts right here. And then these are all your fonts, and what you're going to have to do is you're going to have to drag it from the extracted file, drag the font, and drop it right into here. And then it'll be then installed in your fonts. So that's how you do that for Windows XP. But for Vista and 7, it's really simple as I just showed you. Just right click and install. So that's how you download and install fonts. Check out the site, there's tons of cool fonts. I could spend an hour looking through them all. So, um, yeah, all the links will be in the description, and thanks for watching.